Hello, I'm Seth with Land House, and this is a hydraulic ram pump. It's a water pump that requires no fuel or electricity to operate, only flowing, falling water. A question that I'm asked quite often, what happens if you use a ram pump drive pipe that steps up bigger and bigger as it gets closer to the water source? Well, today we're going to find out that answer. So, I'm gonna run this pump two times. First, I've got my five gallon bucket full on about three feet of head pressure here. A half inch PVC drive pipe comes down here for uh, 60 feet and then drops down maybe another two feet or so to a half inch ram pump. What I want to do is run this pump in this setup and count the number of cycles for about a minute and then see what the pressure builds up to here. Let's let that out. Okay, and then we will repeat this uh, ram pump test, but we'll have 20 feet of half inch, it'll step up to 20 feet of three quarter inch, and then it'll step up once again to one inch to the pump. And that will give us some pretty good results on whether it's better to stay consistent with a ram pump drive pipe or step up as you go closer to the bucket. My prediction, better to have a consistent size throughout the whole setup. Okay, here we go. I'm getting ready to turn on the stopwatch and we're gonna count the cycles here. Uh, the pipe should be full. Let's go ahead and get this primed up. Oh, here we go, okay. And stopwatch is going. Three, four, five. We gotta redo this test. The uh, pump keeps sliding forward and when I placed a rock on the drive pipe, it uh, improved efficiency significantly. So let me put a few rocks on here to keep it from uh, moving around. Okay, redo on this test with some rocks on the drive pipe to keep it into position. Okay, pressure is reset. Let's get this thing to prime here. Shouldn't take much, okay. Three, four, five, Six, 51, 52, 53. All right, in one minute we had 53 cycles and a pressure of uh, 64. 64, 53. The help has arrived. Emma's out here now. She loves to uh, play with the ram pumps. So, uh, I've swapped over to the three different sizes. I was a bit disappointed because uh, I was able to get this connected to the bucket just fine. Uh, let's not stand on that, okay? But I did not have the one component to go from one inch to three quarter. I had to use this T, which is terrible, and step up to one and a quarter and then down to three quarter. Uh, so we may actually have to uh, redo this test later next year when I have the right component. But anyway, steps down to half inch. Let's go down here and run this test again. We already know it's gonna be less efficient because of that 90 degree. Uh, but let's see what we get here. Everything is set. All right. Got the stopwatch ready to go. Wow. I want me to try it. Okay. Whoop, don't get wet now. Okay, let's let go. All right, we're gonna see if it'll run on its own, okay? Up oh, here it goes, okay, let it go. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, there is our time, and that was 94 clicks in a minute, and the pressure got up to 40. So, uh, a couple of thoughts here. I know that 90 degree up here is slowing this down tremendously. Um, so that's gonna be uh, an issue. But uh, it's 40 PSI versus 64. So it's significant and uh, the cycles were much faster. So uh, as I was predicting, when you step up to a larger drive pipe, it, uh, the pressure wave is dissipating faster and faster as it goes up the pipe 
and uh, it just reduces the efficiency uh, a good bit. So, you're so dirty. How did this happen? You pushed over the bucket. Okay. Oh well. Well, hey, can we can wash your hands. Okay. In the bath? About in the bath. Maybe just in the sink. Maybe just in the sink. I want to go back home. Okay. Dad, well, carry me. Yeah, I'll carry you. But first, I have to pull all these pieces of pipe back up, okay? And then we'll go back to the house. <laughs> So uh, we will revisit this test, maybe even step up to like a two inch pipe or one and a quarter to see just how it reduces the efficiency. But that's kind of what I was expecting to happen and it happened, but we'll definitely retest without this 90 degree here. Thank you so much for watching. I have four different ram pump sizes available at landhouse.com and on Amazon. Links in the description down below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.